Hi guys, welcome to our channel. I hope you are fine. We are trying to be fine. So we are in like highway in Bursa. This is Hildrem. Can you tell me about Bursa? Uh, Bursa, yeah, Bursa is the fourth biggest city in yeah, Turkey. So nearly three million population. Apion is just two hundred twenty thousand. Apion is was the uh, first na city na doon in the United States. In Bursa, it's more than three million. And Bursa has how many districts? But city, I mean city center has three districts. Uh, Nilefev, Osman Gazi, and Yildir. Osman Gazi, Osman Gazi is the founder of Ottoman Empire. And Bursa is the founder still of Ottoman Empire. That's why, the, you know, that district name is Osman Gazi. Gazi is like a veteran. If you if you go to war and if you are injured, you are Gazi. In uh, Turkish and Arabic, you Gazi. If you are injured, but we are staying you, in. If you, or if you have a victory, they call you Gazi. Osman Gazi, like Osman, like Victor. But we are staying in Yildirim. Yeah, Yildirim. Yildirim is the is the nickname of uh, another uh, sultan of uh, Ottoman Empire, Yildirim Bayezid. So this is the train. Nilüfer, yes. Nilüfer was the Nilüfer was a, a Byzant, I don't know what to say a East Roman Empire princess uh, before Istanbul was conquered of. By, by Ottoman Empire was Byzance. Byzance is East Ottoman Empire, and uh, Nilüfer was a princess of, uh, of East Ottoman Empire. And uh, after he got married, with, uh, she got married with uh, Orhan Gazi. Orhan Gazi is the son of Osman Gazi, second Sultan of Ottoman Empire. And after she got married with Orhan Gazi. She converted to Islam and uh, she changed her name Nilfer. Nilfer is a flower, lake flower. I don't know what's called in English. And uh, one of district uh, is, uh, you know, they give, gave uh, her name Nilfer, Osman Gazi, and Yildirim. We are living in Yildirim. Anyway, we go down because we will buy. Bread. You know, in Turkey, bread. Let's see the bread. This one? What is this inside? She yok, nothing. Bunda ne var? Börek istiyor musun? Börek ne kadar? It's okay. It's my turn to drive. We are outside because we have important things to do 
And after our work, we'll go home because our twins are waiting for us. Since we are living in Bursa, Turkey, I want to tackle the short history of Bursa while driving around. Bursa is a city in northwestern Turkey and the administrative center of Bursa province. The fourth most populous city in Turkey and second most populous in the Marmara region. Bursa is one of the industrial centers of the country. Most of Turkey's automotive production takes place in Bursa. Bursa was the first major and second overall capital of the Ottoman state between 1335 and 1363. The city was referred to as Hudavendiyar. It's an Ottoman Turkish. I don't know if it's I pronounced it correctly. Meaning God's gift. A name of Persian origin during the Ottoman period. While a more recent nickname is Yeshil Bursa or Green Bursa. Because the Yeshil in Turkish, it means green, green color. So Yeshil Bursa in reference to the parks and gardens located across its urban fabric, as well as to the vast and richly varied forest of the surrounding region. Mount Uludag, the ancient mission Olympus, towers over it and has a well-known ski resort. Bursa has rather orderly urban growth and borders a fertile plain. The mausoleums of the early Ottoman sultans are located in Bursa, and the city's main landmarks include different edifices built throughout the Ottoman period. Bursa also has thermal baths, old Ottoman mansions, palaces, and several museums. As to the economy, Bursa is the largest production center of the Turkish automotive industry. Factories of motor vehicle producers, as well as automotive parts producers, have been active in the city for decades. The textile and food industries are equally strong, as well as fresh and canned food industries being present in the city's organized industrial zones. I guess that brief history suffice. I need to stop near the park because my husband will buy some goods and pasalubong for the twins. Home. Actually, there are two parks. This one is the big park from here to there. Yes, I think just three minutes or five minutes. Walking from our home to this park. Usually, Turkish people mm, they prefer tea compared to the coffee.